clip her up. New Farm traffic from Gold Fox to Whiskey Lima Romeo, backtracking the westerly for departure to the west. New Farm. New Farm traffic from Gold Fox to Whiskey Lima Romeo, lining up runway 27, New Farm. Yeah, Roger, line up and take off at your discretion. A bit nippy here today so anyway hi everyone and welcome to the channel and today it's all about the new farm fly-in it's about four fly-ins that have all been amalgamated together i'll leave a list on the screen now because uh, the weather and restrictions have yeah leave Romeo. can you tell me what the cloud base is yeah new farm from leave romeo i'll climb up and let you know thank you oh, well Right, well, we'll try the intro again, uh, as I was given a task to find out what the cloud base was, and it's 2,000 feet above surface. Anyway, uh, welcome back to the channel, everyone, and today it's probably just a very short video, uh, sharing all the fun and games at the New Farm fly-in. It's multiple fly-ins, and I will leave the, uh, the list of the fly-ins on the screen now, because Courtney's had to amalgamate about four, I think, into one. Uh, already got loads of flyers, so anyway, I'll leave you a little bit of a montage, but don't run away yet because there's a guy called Adrian Jones who is going to be doing a talk tonight, and hopefully, I'll grab some of that footage, if not an interview with him, to talk about electrifying a CFM streak shadow. So, micro light picture on the screen now, and that should give you an indication of what he's trying to do in the feet for that. So anyway, I'm just enjoying the sky up here. I'm going to land in a bit uh, and I say get on with the rest of the barbecues, food and enjoying the company of other pilots. And this is the part of the the, uh, the video I was talking about when I was flying and the gentleman beside me is Adrian and I'll get him to do a little bit of an introduction to himself and and why I'm interviewing him right now so Adrian please give a little bit of your your very intriguing background as to why we stood beside your magnificent aeroplane <laughs> uh, well I'm Adrian Jones I started started out in the aircraft industry working for Rolls-Royce and British Aerospace in Bristol um, I did aeronautics at university uh, more recently, I worked for the British Microlight Association, where I learned all about microlights, bought a shadow, and decided to convert it to electric, because I think electric is the future. Also, Adrian has a YouTube channel, which is covering all of this, so I'll put the link to his channel in the description. So if you're really interested in electric aircraft and the future of where aviation will go with electric aircraft, 
please have a look at his channel. But how did you come up with the idea to electrify one of these? Because this aircraft behind us is actually one of my childhood aircraft. Oh, right. I always wanted to fly in one of these. They just look fantastic and so futuristic for when they were designed. But why did you end up wanting to electrify one? Well, well yes, it was probably the most advanced uh, British Micronite in 1983-84 when it was first developed. Um, it's a very good, uh, efficient uh, Micronite. It's normally a two-seater. I'm converting it to a single-seater, um, deregulated aircraft, what's known as an SSDR, which means you can do virtually anything to it without having to go through the approval process. So it'll be a single-seater. Uh, it's got a very big wing. It's very floaty, uh, very efficient, ideal um, subject to convert to electric power. Um, the engine is at the back. Um, that'll be replaced by a relatively small motor, um, 70 kilograms of batteries. Um, they'll go more or less where the, en where the engine is now to keep the centre of gravity in the same place. Um, so it's, it's a very easy conversion. And I think the batteries now are at such a stage that uh, two hours duration is possible. Brilliant. That's where we'll, we'll wrap this up now. Hopefully you can see why I have such a passion for this really, really unique looking aircraft. Um, Adrian, thank you very much. And I said, if those that want to follow his conversion of his aircraft, I think you're looking into early next year and late next year for flight trials, aren't you? Yeah, that's right. I'm working on the airframe at the moment. So yeah. The motor and the batteries will go in next yeah. spring. So there's a whole load of back catalogue of videos. Catch up with his channel, subscribe to Adrian's channel and follow his electric conversion of a street shadow. So Adrian, thank you very much for your time. Pleasure. Farm traffickers, Golf, Lima, Romeo, joining down Renfrew on 27, New Farm. Okay, joining Chexfield is ahead of me, fuel is on and definitely got sufficient. Atomy is set, still on QFE, and what is closed, I am still secure. I need to get down as well. So anyway, this is uh, me rejoining now for my landing. Always like a nice landing, but there's a few more rain showers around. So I'd rather be on the ground than get very wet in the air. good awareness no other traffic wind is pretty much down the runway ish on the right knows we're steering straight hands while it's closed trim is fixed and i'm still secure a bit of speed a bit of center line Hi everyone and thank you for getting this far in the video. I completely forgot to do an outro on the airfield. It was just such an eventful weekend. And again, a big thank you to Courtney and his family, Jackie especially, 
or organizing all the catering for everyone that wanted to eat as much food as they wanted. It's such a friendly airfield to go to. Courtney and your family, thank you again. A big thank you is also to Adrian Jones for his interview. And again, check out his channel. The, the interview he actually did, the presentation he did in the hangar there, um, he has actually got his channel. So please go and have a look at that. And it'll give you a lot more detail than I could ever cover in the very brief interview I had with him in front of his aircraft. So anyway, we'll wrap this video up here. Until next time, everybody, fly safe. Thank you.